Welcome back. Got some more Angelina on our hands here. Love, don't let me go. Don't let me go, love. Don't let me go, love. Uh, okay, Al, look, thank you for the heads up. And many of other of you have mentioned that she just came down with another drop, another song just uh, last week, I think on the 5th. And so we got we to gotta, we gotta get on board here for some more Angelina. And I know I've got a whole pond to dive into of her content. Um, it doesn't seem like I've even scratched the surface, but you know, we got a rotation and a lot of, a lot of great recommendations. I don't think that I could ignore hardly any of your recommendations, especially you, Al. <laughs> I gotta always go with you, buddy. But yeah, so love, don't let me go by Angelina. Let's, let's get this thing going. Here we go. Whoa. No longer the barefoot little girl. She's got a little Porsche going. Okay, about a half a can of hairspray. Looks very retro-esque. You got the old style Porsche there with the guitar in the back seat. That could be mom. Maybe mom. Let me know, is this mom? How oh, goodness. Hey, you're good. You're good. All right, little music video. Here we go. <laughs> I take it back. Mistakes and regrets ain't all that I have left. Cause your touch and your sense still on my skin. Wow. Wow. First of all, first of all, that, that, look, she can spit, she can spit it out like major smooth, major smooth vocals. And then she can just flip the switch, throw a little rasp in there. The vibrato is just kicking in in a very, it's weird to have a vibrato with a real raspy kind of edge to it. Um, and it, it just, look, it, I've said it before. She's quite the chameleon. She's she can she can hop, skip, and jump from one style to another. When we contrast what she was like when she was a little little punk back until today, you can see there's a uh, the expected progression that we would all expect with Angelina. She's she's filling into her own as far as her vocals are concerned and everything. She's just like growing into her vocals. Clearly, I mean, you listen to some of her older stuff which was mind blow based on what she could do based on her age. But I think we all knew, or at least most of you did, because I was kind of on, uh, into this party a little late. Um, looking at her older stuff, you can kind of tell, wow, that's incredible for that age. But can you imagine what it's going to be like for when she gets older? And here we are. I mean, this is it. She's, she's arriving. She still has room to grow. It's just because only not not because of her inability to sing, but her she's still a young kid, she's still young, and as she still matures and matures, I just am afraid because it's like oh my gosh, how much better can a vocalist get? This is yeah, wow. Maybe I'm a fool to erase the trace. It, this feels very, very retro. It feels very 1950s throwback feel. The the band that she's got, it's a very simple backup of a vocal like this that just sounds very, to me, it sounds very much um, like a James Bond cover. You know, just just what it feels like, a old Sean Connery kind of, kind of vibe to the whole thing. But um, yeah. Let's, let's keep going. You know me, at least that's how I feel. Listen to that. Listen to that vocal. I'm trying to pull you close, closer to me, but it's just like trying to catch small. Love, I really wish you had a face. Maybe I could beg for you to stay. I'm on. Even on stay, I mean, how does she do that? Uh, I don't understand how she understand. I mean, how she has that kind of control on that vibrato the way she does. It just it's so distinct, and it it's 
It's almost like as it goes up and down, it hits specific pitches up and down like a yodel in a way. A yodel? A yodel? Yeah, it's just that's what it's kind of like. Listen to the word, just the word. Listen to the word, just stay. I mean, come on. <laughs> what? It's not about feeling lonely. But man, I Mama. just forget. And though you're not here beside me, I still see your silhouette. I'm trying to pull you close, closer to me. But it's just like trying to catch smoke. Love, I really wish you had a face. Maybe I could be. I want that car. Love don't let me go. If only I could look you in the eye. There wouldn't be no place for you to hide. I'm on the floor. I'm begging. Oh, oh, oh. Love don't let me go. It's effortless. She's, she does this effortlessly. It's just, oh, I'll just sing a song. I'll, I'll, I'll crush it. No big deal. She walks off. Oh, jeez. Look, you either you either got it, or you don't. She's got it. She's got it. I mean, it's just like it's so fun to see her grow into her vocals, become a young lady, all of it. Just to see her her growth. And transition. I know I was late to the party. I know that uh, you know when we look at her vocals when she was a kid compared to now. Look, there's no, there's no questioning at the time when she was a child singing these majorly incredible jazz riffs, knowing that for her age it was incredible. But then an awareness of knowing that she is going to just kill it. Like I said, it's just like here she is. Here she is, and she's got even more growing to do. She's going to grow even further in her vocals. She's still young. She's still got room to improve. Think of that. Anyways, look, what can I say? What can I say? We got ourselves on our hands. A little bit of Angelini Jordan. More to come. Thanks, Al. You guys have a good day. Take care.